Hey guys, welcome back to T's Beauty Factory. So I'm back with my final review of this eyeshadow palette that I got from Five Below. You guys, if you have a Five Below near you, in your area or whatever, I strongly suggest you guys going to look in their makeup section because they do have makeup brushes, they have all types of fun makeup stuff, and they did have eyeshadow palettes as well. This is the one that I chose to get from there. I'm not sure if your five below will have it, but there's no harm in going to check. I love going to five or below. I always end up spending way too much money in there and everything that I always want to get is like $5. So those $5 add up, I end up spending $60 in there. But hey, you know, I'm so excited that I got this, you guys. It's so beautiful. And literally as bright as the colors look on the palette is how they come out. Like this is the look that I decided to do with the palette today. I did use a basic um, eyeshadow primer that I got that was like a dollar that I got from the Shop Miss A site, which is a website that sells makeup, cosmetics, and all type of other fun girly stuff, and everything literally is like a dollar on their website. But I did just use that basic primer, and then I used a normal just eyeshadow brush, and I think the eyeshadow brush I used, I got for a dollar too from Dollar Tree. But I just placed the eyeshadows. I did this like type of rainbow look because I wanted to try to use every color in the palette so I could get like a full review of every color that I used. You guys, I also have my Born in the 90s shirt on, which I'm so excited about because it has all the good favorite characters on there from all the old good classic cartoons. I love this shirt and I'm literally can't wait till I get paid again so I can go back to Five Below and get more of these shirts because they have all types of different character shirts. And they had like this beautiful colorful Toy Story one that I really, really wanted that I feel like I could slay with this eyeshadow palette with that shirt. Like, I love the way the look I did came out. It's super pretty. It's like, it's not too much, but it's also very popping and bright. And I freaking love it. Like, I'm so glad that I decided to get this palette, you guys. It really does, like, the pit colors really do come out as bright as they look, which is crazy to me because this palette was $5, y'all. Like I told y'all before, I'm very affordable when it comes to my makeup. I love makeup so much, but I love finding, you know, good deals and discounts on stuff where you can slay, you know, with a $5 eyeshadow palette that's still as bright and pretty and good quality. So that's what I'm really all about when it comes to my makeup. But just look at this eyeshadow palette, you guys. I did use the brightest color of each color because there's like multiple blues and greens and yellows, but there is like a brighter green and a darker green and like, you know, a brighter yellow and then a golden yellow and then a darker yellow. So like the rainbow is super bright. So, you know, I tried to use the brightest colors of each color that I was trying to do. I think it came out really good. You guys, and this eyeshadow palette is literally to die for. I'm so glad I got it, you guys. I'm so glad I got this shirt because it's literally like, this is probably gonna be the favorite, my favorite t-shirt that I own now. Like I don't own many t-shirts. So whenever I get good character t-shirts, it probably becomes my favorite shirt for a while until it starts to, you know, until I get a different one. But <laughs> I'm definitely gonna go back and I'm probably gonna film my process of me going into five and below, as long as I'm by myself and my kids aren't with me because I can't do anything with them around. Like, literally, they just ruin everything. <laughs> they ruin everything when you try to film and it's just not gonna go well. I already know I'm gonna be telling them not to grab that, don't touch that, you know, no, that's not gonna work. I'm gonna have to go by myself when my husband is at home with the kids or something. That way I can film the process of me shopping and, you know, how I shop in five below. <laughs> But you have to like go around that store a hundred times just, just so you don't miss anything because there's so much good stuff in that store. Like, it's amazing, y'all. They did have other eyeshadow palettes. I'm probably now gonna go back and get, like the makeup section is probably gonna be the first place I go now when I go into Five and Below. So I am gonna go back in there, hopefully next week or my next payday, and you know, show you guys my finds in there. So this is how the palette looked, the color, came out super beautiful it wasn't hard for me to put it onto the eyeshadow brush there is a there wasn't much fallout which I was extremely shocked about because I have Juvia's Place palettes and some BH Cosmetic palettes that have fallout so that was really surprising to me I expected it to be you know more fallout whenever I was doing it my eyeshadow and placing my eyeshadow but shockingly there really wasn't much 
So you guys see how I'm barely like rubbing them, right? Look at that. Five dollars, y'all. And every color is just like every color is literally so bright and vibrant. Like they did a good job on this palette and these colors. I'm obsessed. I'm so glad that I literally, I'm so glad that I decided to get the palette because it's so pretty and it's so, the colors are just perfect. It's like the perfect, whenever you think of a rainbow palette, you know, this is the colors that you expect to have in your palette. Like all the super bright colors and they have like a bright blue and a dark blue. It's just perfect. Like I love the palette so much. And I would love to look up the company and see if I could find more palettes by them. But so far I haven't been able to find anything. I don't know if they just, you know, make stuff for department stores or what, but I'm gonna look more into it. It is by the company Color Co. If you go to your five and below, but you can't find it, but you happen to be able to find an online website or something, you know, that is the company name. I am just like, I didn't expect much from this palette when I got it, y'all. Of course, you know, of course I did it. It's a $5 palette that I'm getting from Five Below, you know. I didn't expect much. So my overall final results are like shocking. Like I'm literally shocked and taken aback by how beautiful this palette is. Like the colors are perfect. They have this, they're so bright, y'all. It makes you like, I'm just in love. So I definitely recommend you guys go into your five below near you or, you know, try to find the online palette if you can find online. But I don't know how much it'll be online, but it was $5 in my store. But, you know, if you guys can find this palette, I definitely will get it. It's definitely a good, you know, addition to your collection, especially if you need a bright color palette for the summertime or, you know, just just to have it in your collection whenever you want to do a super bright look. Even if you don't use all the colors, you know, I tried to use every color <laughs> at once because I wanted to make sure every color was just as pigment, that they that it get, um, that they all gave out the same color payoff. So that's why I tried to do, you know. But when I do go to use this palette again, of course I'm probably gonna end up just using one color depending on, you know, what my makeup look is gonna be for that day. But if you just need a super bright color for an event, like if you're wearing, if it's your birthday and you wanna put some pink shadow on your lid and some bomb lashes, this palette will definitely help you succeed that beautiful, bright, you know, glowy look. I love it so much, you guys. So definitely go to your five and below and check that out their makeup section to see if you can find it. Also, look at their t-shirts because they have some nice character t-shirts. This shirt is literally my entire life. Like my life has been waiting to have this shirt. And I probably, I wanna get more shirts now that say, that have something to do with the 90s um, era because that's probably the best year. Yeah, that's probably the best year. The 90s, the whole full 90s, 1991, 1990, all that. I was born in 1994 myself. March 21st, so I am an Aries, you guys, but, which is another best sign to be, <laughs> by the way, but, I love it, I'm so glad I got it, you guys, I hope you guys love it, I hope you guys love how my eye uh, look for today, I can't, it's Sunday, you guys, happy Sunday, I am gonna start uploading every Saturday and Sunday, I have a ton of videos lined up for you guys, like, literally, I have so many, y'all have no idea. Just make sure you're subscribed to my channel so you don't miss anything. Like this video, you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Love you.